Okay, so I got my drink for the ride home. Um, I got a green tea matcha with vanilla, sugar-free vanilla. Um, let me know what your sugar-free drinks are below. I'm just trying to eat less sugar 
if that makes sense. Um, but I gotta wipe that off right before I can partake. Okay, so I always use have wipes in my car, and before I drink any Starbucks drink or anything like that. Let me fix that. Before I drink anything like that, um, when someone hands me a cup, I wipe it off. And, you know, you can never be too sure. Even if I'm not drinking out of it, which I'm not because I have a straw. But their hands, they don't have gloves on. They're touching them with their hands. And then when they put the lid on, you guys, they touch the, mm -mm, they touch the rim. So, no, 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 thank you. Clean your cups. Clean your cups. I know you're fine, believe me, but clean your cups. Never be too sure. Anyways, so I'm headed home. Hopefully my husband did dinner. He's supposed to. Today's his day off, so I typically work on his day off. And yeah, so we will see how that goes. Hopefully, because I'm hungry. Oh. I typically don't eat what they eat anyways. Fun fact about me, I don't like meat. <laughs> I may eat it occasionally, and when I say occasionally, it's like some little pieces of grilled chicken or um, what else is there? That's pretty much it. I love vegetables, love vegetables. I will definitely um, do like what I eat in the day video because I think that would be interesting to see what I eat uh, just for my own resources like just to go back and see like what did I eat or what you know things like that because a lot of times we don't keep track of what we eat. Also don't touch your face if um i said i know you guys just saw me use the inside of my shirt to wipe my lips not the outside of it the inside and this was under my scrub shirt excuse me <laughs> this was under my scrub shirt and also my scrub jacket buttoned up so this was not exposed but even still i use the inside of my shirt and i try to teach my boys too when they're at school you know, grab the tail end of your shirt and tuck it under and use it because don't rub your eyes, don't do anything like that. You know what my son had the audacity to tell me? Yeah, you Braxton. Now, mind you, you already know I'm a dermaphobe. This is pre-panorama. -pan well, <laughs> I stalked him with Lysol wipes to wipe down his desk in each class. I stocked him with hand sanitizer and I know he eats lunch at school. So, and plays, um, and he does, uh, what is it called? Um, PE. He had the audacity to tell me one day, I said, son, do you use the hand sanitizer I give you? And he was like, no. Why? Why do I go through these efforts? like mama I just used the hand sanitizer in and out of class I'm like yeah but you touch your desk you touch doorknobs you touch stuff it's just nasty I'm like whatever do you do you son he's my oldest now my youngest one he could be a surgeon that boy is taken after his mother when it comes to germs and watching out and we, we were in the store the other day and he literally somebody coughed he was like uh-uh he like went like about face and started walking the other way i was like right son right so anyways i thought that was funny i wanted to tell you guys my day was great very i did about 14 15 patients and abdomen renals one pelvic a neck evaluate for lymph nodes and what else? I think that's it. I think that's like the majority of my list of what I did. Um, oh, and a couple breasts. I did not see anything. No pathology found, thank God. That's what I pray for. I'm like, Lord, please don't let me find anything. 
And if I do find something, let it be like a simple cyst. Nothing crazy, you know. Um, I pray over my patients. I don't know about you, but I pray over my patients. Um, But yeah, so that was my day. I'm going to head home and I will see you in a minute. Pause it for a second, son. Okay, guys, what's up? I am back at home now. I showered. My hair looks wild because real, real fast. So I am allergic to Let's Jam. However, I thought I was allergic to Let's Jam, like hair, like grease type gel type substance. Um, when I was a little kid, I was. And I broke out like all around my face. Well, I've been noticing lately because I've been using it. And I've been using edge control. Um, and I don't know what it is in those products. And I did not realize, Braxton, seriously, you want to say hi to the vlog? Say hi. Hi. Oh, my goodness. Um, and I did not realize that I was still allergic. So, yeah, I'm still allergic. And my scalp is on fire right now. So, I just got off the phone with my sister. Um, she's like, wash your hair again. Because I've been washing, I wash my hair every day because that's just nasty. And I probably shouldn't, but when you work in the hospital, when you work and you just feel grimy and dirty, I want to go ahead and wash my hair. So I washed my hair and now she says, wash it again, massage it real well, don't scratch and um, don't scratch and just be and let that sit for 10 minutes. And then rinse it and then do it again. So hopefully that will take care of my problem. But um, so anywho, I am back at home real fast. If you guys have kids and you're working and you have a nine to five or eight to five, um, try to find some work balance. Like I still have kids. I have one son, as you saw in the background. Don't excuse my face. I look a hot mess. But um. <laughs> I have one son in the background who is going is in high school first year. He has been diagnosed with um attention deficit, so it's kind of hard for him to stay on track, but um I'm going to knock him out. So, with that being said, I help him after you're off the hook. I help him with his homework when I come home, but um or he'll do his homework and whatever he has left over will work out we'll work it out together the other thing is that um it's it's complicated it's hard you know we work we still have to be a mom we still have to be you know energized for our kids and also come home and cook dinner if you don't have a co-partner um i do and sometimes he worked like right now he just told me hey i have to go into work so um, he's a manager, so I get it, but now it's my duty to do dinner, and I don't even know what time it is. What time is it? 8 o'clock? 8.08. And so, um, but I said that to say, try to find a work balance. I did groceries on the road with Instacart, and so by the time I got here, the groceries were here, and, um... I took a shower and now I'm about to go and fix them a quick dinner and also do my son's homework. And we all have to do that by 10 o'clock tonight so mommy can get some good night rest. So um, there is balance. There is, you know, of course, we're going to struggle, but we have to find time for every little piece in our life to fit and nestled perfectly. Um, God gave us 24 hours in a day. That's plenty of hours that we do that we have to work what we need to do so um i'm a firm believer of that just don't overstretch yourself um you have you know eight hours at work you come home and you may not have time to do youtube or you know um watch tv or read a book but those are those nestled little moments where hey, let me go take a shower and you play some jazz music and you just kind of relax for a second or 10, 20 minutes and then you get back to the grind. And by the time the kids go to bed, you know, take 30 minutes to yourself. 
wind down, no screen time, just kind of, you know, light a candle, read a book, and go from there. But, um, and use Instacart. Instacart's been my favorite friend since we've been in the panor pan what is it, panorama. panorama. And um, it's helped out so much. You know, they shop with you. You don't have to have a membership um, to use it. You don't, but if you do want to use it, um, I'll link, leave a link in the description box where you guys can get, I think, $10 off your first order. But, um, and I'm not, it's not sponsored. Believe me, I'm, it's not. I pay for it with my own money. But uh, Instacart, holler at your girl if you want to. Um, but I absolutely love it. They go to Costco. They go to Sam's Club. Um, I order tissue. I order, uh, what is it, paper towels, food, anything that my family may need. Um, so definitely utilize it and take the stress off of you. And, um, I haven't been, I'll go to like a Target or a Walmart, but I have not been grocery shopping in I don't know how long because that's what I use even when I'm at home. Um, I want to spend as much quality time with my kids as possible. So I, you know, sit down and in the evening and do my order. And by the t next morning it's here. So, and Walmart has delivery service as well. But um, yeah, so just FYI, take the stress off you a little bit. Um, Trader Joe's does not deliver. I wish they did. But um, other than that, I'll go to Trader Joe's. Well, hi, love. You're back home, huh? Mm -hmm. What did you have to do at work? Tell the vlog. They haven't seen you in a while. What you said? I didn't go to work. I went to the store. You said you was going to the, st uh, the store. Mm -hmm. Exactly. I said I was going to the store, and that's exactly where I went. Oh, my bad. Anyway, say hi to the bloke. Supper. That's not hi. I'll never say hi. Hi. There you go. Baby, guess what? What? You know that red that red rash on my neck? Mm -hmm. It's back. And then my scalp mm -hmm. is itching too, but... Some fleas. I don't have fleas. Shut up. What I'm saying is, is that I forgot I was allergic to the Let's Jam products I've been using. And so now my scalp is all irritated. It's not funny. <laughs> I just told them the story. It's not funny. <laughs> Anyways, I'm about to go. And what did you get for dinner? Or are you doing dinner? Since I thought you, I thought he went to work. My bad. I thought I had to do dinner. So where'd, where'd you go? I mean, where'd you get? Uh, I probably do like uh, shrimp scampi, something like that. Shrimp scampi. Yeah, it's easy to fix. Nice. It sounds good. If it was that red lobster. I don't need red lobster. So, anyways, I'm gonna finish helping my son on his homework, help my husband in the kitchen, no. and uh, I, I, you don't need my help. No. But why don't you need my help? Then why don't you go out of the house with a shirt on? I do have a shirt on. Let me see. This is like a shirt. Is that a shirt? It's a shirt. Let's see, let's see that shirt. That is not a shirt. It's a shirt. It's too Tight cold. Arms, sleeves, everything like that. Shirt. That's a nice jacket. That word you get. Your brother. Really? What kind is it? I don't know. Oh, navy. I like the arms on it, but it's not a shirt. Shirt. Anyways, I will talk to you guys in another vlog. Thank you for coming along this day.